video, I am going to explain the relation between resistance, current, power and voltage. Here the pie chart that shows the relation among voltage, current, resistance and power. First of all, I have to take the power. So what is power? Power equal to P into I. So what is power? Power equal to V into I. So what is Ohm's law? From Ohm's law. So V is equal to IR. Constant temperature voltage is directly proportional to the resistance. So V is equal to IR. So from this, instead of P, I have to put IR. So P is equal to what? I square R. P is equal to I square R. So see, from this equation, how to find out I? I is equal to V by R. So see, this V by R have to substitute in the power. So P is equal to instead of I, I have to put instead of the equation num I in the equation number 1, I have to put V by R. So V square by R. So now the three elements are over. V I, I square R, V square by R. Then what is current? Current equal to V by R from this. And what is? Uh, current P by V. We can write like this. I is equal to P by V. And from this equation, how to write the current? So from the, this equation, the current equal to I square I square equal to P by R. I square equal to P by R. And what about I? I is equal to square root of P by R. So in this way also we are going to find out the current square root of P by R. And then consider the voltage. So in the voltage V is equal to I R. Then from the equation of power V is equal to P by I. And from the equation of this equation, what is V square? V square equal to P R. So from this what is V? V into R. From this what is V? V is equal to square root of PR. Square root of PR. In this way you have to relate voltage and the power. And next we have to consider the resistance. R is equal to V by I. And from this what is R? R is equal to P by I square. And from this equation, what is R? R is equal to V square by P. That's all. In this way, we can find the relation between power, current, voltage and resistance. Thank you.